Laying the foundation of a mega project and bringing it to the stage of completion requires huge investment and prolonged hours of planning. But guess what? Most of these lavish projects appeared good only on paper, starting from a well-connected bridge in London to one of the tallest unfinished skyscrapers in China. Lots of buildings have been abandoned and now stand as fall-on structures. Billions of dollars have been wasted on some of the most pricey projects in the world. The tale behind these projects not being completed is quite intriguing. In today's video, we will share with you the three most expensive mega projects that were left incomplete and for which excessive amount of resources have been depleted. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press that like button. While watching, let us know in the comments below if you were aware of any such abandoned mega projects. Let's begin. The construction of the Ruyong Hotel, North Korea's Hotel of Doom, was initiated with the competitive mindset. During the 1950s, North Korea conflicted with South Korea. Later in 1986, watching a South Korean company building the tallest hotel in the world, the Western Stanford in Singapore irked North Korea. That's when the idea of constructing a pyramid-shaped skyscraper was hatched in Pyongyang, the capital of North Korea. It was planned that the lavish hotel would feature a minimum of 3,000 rooms and five revolving restaurants offering wonderful views of the surroundings. Ruyong Hotel was scheduled to be completed in two years, starting in 1987. Sadly, nothing much happened. Although the hotel reached its proposed height in 1992, it was bereft of windows and interior construction. Just like that, the building stood like a gigantic structure, overlooking the city for another 16 years. This $750 million worth of building now stood as a concrete pyramid with absolute hollowness. After the hotel stood upright as a spooky abandoned structure for 16 years, construction started in full-fledged in 2008 after an Egyptian firm decided to get into this contract. A glass facade was installed, thus giving the building a sleek and elegant appearance. Though the project was completed in 2011, repeated delays in its opening raised suspicions among the general public. It was planned to be inaugurated in 2013, but that day never came as it was believed that the building was very unstable and may collapse anytime soon. Pushing away all these speculations, the Grand Hotel came to life in 2018 when it was adorned with glittering LEDs. Since there is no news about its opening, no one knows whether the building will even serve the purpose of a hotel for which it was built. The glass structure has made it difficult for people outside to know what's going on inside the Ruyong Hotel. For several years, it has been standing as a useless structure in North Korea. The North Korean government seems to be ashamed of this costly, embarrassing eyesore because all the pictures of the hotel have been removed from the official images of Pyongyang. It remains to see whether the government decides to open this failed structure for the public by taking the required steps in the coming days. The overly unique project of London Garden Bridge was yet another epic failure. It was planned to be constructed above the elegant Thames River in London. If the construction had gone as planned, London would surely have garnered the opportunity of boasting a captivating floating garden above the river. Unfortunately, the Garden Bridge did not see the light of the day. It was planned that the 366 meter pretty Garden Bridge would be adorned with bulk of trees and vibrant flowers that would demand an estimated cost of $85 million. It was believed that the bridge would serve the purpose of a popular tourist hub with a predicted number of 3 million tourists visiting the spot every year. Initially, it was proclaimed by the builders that the funding for this project would come solely from private sources and that no public funding would be required. However, the Garden Bridge Trust later made a shocking revelation by breaking the news that the construction cost has escalated to $260 million. As a result, it had become evident that the public would have to donate $85 million. This resulted in the generation of severe criticism revolving around the Garden Bridge. The public began to question the usefulness of the bridge. They argued that if the bridge was being constructed for the people, why is it being done so in an area that is already crowded with river crossings? To make matters worse, the architects behind the bridge failed to decide whether the bridge was being constructed for transportation purposes or tourism. 
Though Apple had desired to fund the construction of this grand project, the agreement with this tech company could not be reached as it had placed the condition of establishing an Apple store in the middle of the bridge. Since such a thing would go against the vision of the structure, this idea was eventually rejected. The Garden Bridge project was a massive failure for it cost about $60 million with a surplus design charge of $12.5 million. A bridge that would have looked all rosy and dreamy turned into a great blunder, putting several million dollars to utter waste. Are you enjoying watching this interesting video? Keep watching as yet another surprising tale of a mega project awaits you. Do smash that subscribe button and continue having fun. The super expensive project of Goldian Finance 117 of China resembling a walking stick is an unfinished and abandoned tall skyscraper in the area of Tianjin. Builders started with the construction of this elegant building intending to transcend the Shanghai Tower. Plans were set to make the China 117 Tower emerge as the second tallest skyscraper in the world after the famous Burj Khalifa Tower in Dubai. Plans were made to make the tower a core part of the Golden Metropolitan Project. It was decided to be designed in a way so that it can accommodate villas, hotels, offices and entertainment centre, green space and Apollo Club. With a diamond-shaped crown at the top, the top floors of the tower were planned to accommodate greenery. The builders started the construction in 2008. It was planned that the project would get over by 2014. Construction was put to a halt in January 2010 owing to the Great Economic Recession. However, building activity soon resumed in 2011 and it was then scheduled that the project would attain full completion by 2018-19. Unfortunately, the skyscraper topped out on 8th of September 2015. Since then, no progress has been made yet. As of now, the super tall building stands unfinished. The removal of all on-site workers by the contractor of the project has strengthened the belief that this project was a terrible waste. With the Chinese government's recent law banning skyscrapers exceeding the height of 500 meters, general speculation seems to have turned into a conviction that the Golden Finance 117 would never be completed. The world's tallest abandoned building now stands like an intimidating ghostly structure overlooking the city. Did the stories about these failed mega projects amaze you? Were you aware of any such familiar mega project that has remained unfinished to date? Do let us know your views in the comment section below. If you enjoyed watching the video, do press the like button and tap the subscribe button to keep watching more such astonishing videos. See you in our next video.